Hello, my name is Kurt Jensen, and I'm a certified technical expert at Hank Greff Chevrolet in Davidson. The video you're about to view should give you a thorough explanation of how things work. I personally viewed it myself and found it to be very informative. Enjoy! The Volt has a suite of available active safety features. Volt's active safety features are offered in two packages on up-level models. The Driver Confidence 1 package and the Driver Confidence 2 package. Safety features in the Driver Confidence 2 package include forward collision alert with following distance indicator, low speed front automatic braking, lane keep assist with lane departure warning, and IntelliBeam auto high beams. Ford Collision Alert with following distance indicator is designed to help avoid or reduce severity of front end collision. When the system detects a vehicle ahead, the following distance indicator light will display green. The indicator light will change to amber if you are following too closely. When approaching a vehicle too quickly, the forward collision alert display will flash red on the windshield. A series of rapid high pitched beeps will also be heard. Apply the brake pedal as needed. The Ford Collision Alert System monitors vehicles with a distance of approximately 197 feet and operates at speeds above 25 miles an hour. Working with the Forward Collision Alert System, the low speed front automatic braking feature detects and alerts you of a possible crash threat. If you don't react quickly enough or at all, this feature applies the brakes moderately or hard in an effort to reduce the impact of a crash. The system works when driving forward between 5 and 37 miles per hour. It can detect vehicles up to approximately 197 feet. Low speed front automatic braking may slow the vehicle to a complete stop to try to avoid a potential crash. If this happens, low speed front automatic braking may engage the electric parking brake to hold the vehicle at a stop. The Lane Keep Assist with Lane Departure Warning uses forward-facing camera technology to detect a lane marker on the road. When a left or right lane marker is detected, the system indicator turns green. If the vehicle drifts toward a detected lane marker, the indicator turns amber, and the system provides steering input to gently help steer the vehicle back into the correct lane. Lane Keep Assist steering input can be overridden by turning the steering wheel with normal effort. If you unintentionally drift out of your lane, the integrated lane departure warning system will flash the amber indicator and an audible alert will pulse from the speakers on the side of the lane crossing. The Lane Keep Assist system operates at speeds above 37 miles per hour. It does not activate if you use your turn signal in the direction of the intended lane change or make a sudden evasive maneuver. The Lane Keep Assist camera sensor is on the windshield ahead of the rear view mirror. To turn the Lane Keep Assist on and off, press the Lane Keep Assist symbol on the steering wheel. The last safety feature is the IntelliBeam Auto High Beams. This system automatically activates the high beam headlamps to improve visibility in especially dark conditions. An optical sensor integrated in the interior mirror automatically switches the headlamps to low beam to prevent impairing the vision of drivers and other cars. The system activates the high beams only when driving over 25 miles per hour. Keep this area of the windshield clear of debris to allow for best system performance. The high beam headlamps remain on under the automatic control until one of the following situations occurs. The system detects an approaching vehicle's headlamps. The system detects a preceding vehicle's tail lamps. The outside light is bright enough that the high beam headlamps are not required. The vehicle's speed drops below 12 miles per hour or the IntelliBeam system is disabled by the high low beam changer of the flash to pass feature. To enable the IntelliBeam system, press the indicator symbol on the turn signal lever when the exterior lamp control is in the auto position. The blue high beam on light appears on the instrument cluster when the high beams are on. Safety features are no substitute for your responsibility to operate the vehicle in a safe manner. You should remain attentive to traffic, surroundings, and road conditions at all times. Read the vehicle's owner's manual for more important safety information. I hope that video presentation is a confident on how to operate your personal car technology. If you have any questions, please contact me by phone, email, or at my website, www. Dot .graphguru.com Thanks again for watching and have a great day.